at $236 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $268.16 a share in the next 12. Now, Air Products and Chemicals was mentioned in our this week's option picks. Um, every generally from the this week's winning stocks, I choose one particular stock that I feel will do well as an option. But I don't just pick it. I actually buy it. And I show you guys the results of it over weeks. So let's see how Air Products and Chemicals are doing. I bought Air Products and Chemicals on February 9th. At that time, it was $1,320.66 for an option contract at the strike price that lasted around four months. Well, from that time, and now we're in March 2nd, so maybe around three weeks, it's up $1,046.09. So I'm sitting on top of, and anybody who would have listened to me when I said it, and they would have bought it as well, we're sitting on top of a 79.21% return. Hey guys, this is the February 26th through March 1st edition of this week's winning stocks. And we know that about three weeks ago, the SPY was down a little bit, but it's moved up for the second week since then. It's been on a steady climb, as you can see from here, moving straight up, then down a week, up, down a week up two more weeks. When we look at the Dow, we pretty much see the same thing. We see a steady climb, but three negative weeks, but very slightly negative. And the NASDAQ, we see the same thing. We see a steady climb and Two negative weeks, one here, one here. Been up for the last couple of weeks. We know we like to look at the S&P 500, the Dow and the NASDAQ, because those give us a pretty much an idea of the way the entire market is moving. So, as we get to our watch list, we know from our watch list that I break it up into three tiers. Three stars is the most fundamentally sound stocks on our watch list. Two stars are beneath that, not as fundamentally sound, but not at the bottom. And one star is at the bottom. It's the least most fundamentally sound on the watch list still considered fundamentally sound enough to be on the watch list, but the least of the group. Well, our first stock is Weiss Markets. It's a one star. At $64.24 a share, Yahoo analysts don't have an estimate on how high this stock can go up, but my estimate based on PE ratio is $87.27 a share. We see that it's moving in sort of a sideways pattern. This week it went a little high. Let's see if it breaks out of that in the next week. Next we have Marriott Vacations. A one star also. Moving in a sideways pattern this previous week, it started to move out. But then last week was a negative week again, but only slightly. 
We want to see what it does moving forwards. It's $93.94 a share right now. Yahoo analysts estimate it can move up to $110.57 in the next 12 months. We have Method Electronics. Now, we know it's difficult to find a fundamentally sound stock at a low price. But Method Electronics is at a low price at $21.60 a share. It's a one star. Yahoo analysts estimate it can move up to $28.50 a share in the next 12 months. Now, Method Electronics is just moving in a sideways pattern so far. Hasn't broken out yet, but they do have an earnings report coming up. And that earnings report is March 7th. So we know an earnings report is like being at a casino. You don't know if you're going to walk out broke or walk out rich. It can go either way. An earnings report is like a report card for companies. And if it turns out well, the stock can really jump. If it turns out bad, the stock can really drop. So if any are considering buying it or even own it, but you don't have the stomach for going through the earnings report, you want to get out before that day where it drops. Advance 6. They are a two-star, currently at $27.27 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $37.33 a share in the next 12 months. They moved down the last two months, but on two, two weeks, but only slightly. And they moved up considerably about three weeks ago. So we could watch them and see what happens. Genuine Parts Company. This is a stock that's going to be removed from our watch list after this week. They are a two-star. Currently at $149.21 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $156 in the next 12 months. Omega Flex, they are a three-star. They're moving in a sideways pattern, currently at $69.41 a share. Yahoo analysts don't have an estimate, but my estimate based on P.E. ratio is that they can move up to $108.65 a share in the next 12 months. Now guys, I want to take a brief pause here to introduce a video on the speaking about a new service that's going to be offered for this week's winning stocks. So let's jump to that now. I want to talk to you about an experience that I had which can dramatically improve your investing success. So I was recently speaking to a family member who I showed some things about investing and picking stocks, which really worked out for her. It worked out for her so well that her investing with options particularly dramatically improved. We know options deals with stocks. So in any event, she was sharing with me a new strategy she's using and explained to me how she just recently ended up making a lot of money on NVIDIA. What I explained to her 
is that my my strategy is successful as well. I don't feel there's any need to change it. And at the time I was speaking, though I was pretty sleepy, but after I got up, I said, you know what, let me address this. And I explained to her that in my strategy, I already had NVIDIA on my watch list. The only difference is at the time we had that conversation, NVIDIA was $788.17 a share. I actually showed her a screenshot of where NVIDIA moved up from. And I sent her the properties of one of my files, NVIDIA Corporation. This is the stock analysis on NVIDIA that I created. And you see the date here is created June 30th of 2022. That's approximately 20 months earlier. Also notice it says modified May 27th of 2023. And I'll explain why I show that to you in a second. In any event, I did this analysis 20 months ago. And when I did this analysis, NVIDIA was not $780. It was $145 and 23 cents a share. Now, if anybody had bought 100 shares of NVIDIA at that time, it would have cost them $14,523. Unless they were using margin, it would have cost around 7000 something. And they would have been able to sell those shares for $64,294 20 months later. That's a $442. 0.70% gain. But that's not why I'm putting this little video together. I'm putting this together to explain to you something. Currently, the only thing I do is I check the financials for these companies for the most for the five most recent years and I check to see I only check them when they're at their annual low price every stock that said it's annual low price and it's fundamentally sound based on the last five years of financial research i add to the watch list what i don't do is i don't check for research news so what i've decided to start doing is for the stocks that's in this week's stock winners, not all of them, because I have a lot in there, but for the ones with the most potential, we will now be doing not only five-year financial analysis at the annual low price, which we currently do, we will also be, which you will find if you go to my YouTube channel, Uncle Dwayne's Watchlist, you'll now see a link for Patreon. If you click on that link and go into Patreon, we will also be doing upcoming news on the stocks on the watch list. So, it will show you fundamentally sound stocks moving up from their annual low price, but it will also include information such as upcoming news with that company, risk factors for the company to consider, upcoming projects for the company, things that they could be working on to make them a lot more money, and much more. Because realize when you're working with stocks, you're basically working with companies, stocks or shares of a company. I will also have this week's option picks for those who are familiar with it will be changed on the YouTube channel to this month's option pick and the weekly option picks will be moved into the 
Patreon channel. And also, if you want a video call with Uncle Dwayne to discuss anything concerning investments, you'll get two 30-minute video calls a month. And each of these individual packages are $25. So those will be moved inside of the Patreon. There'll still be a this week's winning stocks. But the more advanced analysis with news and so forth will be inside of the Patreon channel. Our next stock is Darling Ingredients. Darling Ingredients is currently at $43.67 a share. They are a two star and they're moving in a sideways pattern. We wanna see if they break out of that sideways pattern here. Yahoo analysts estimate that they can go up to $66.18 a share in the next 12 months. Chevron Corporation, they are a one star, currently at $177, no, I'm sorry, currently at $152.81 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $177.11 a share in the next 12 months. And they are just slightly moving out of a sideways pattern, but been negative, slightly negative for the last couple of weeks. MGP Ingredients. MGP Ingredients is a two star, currently at $86.04 a share. Now, MGP Ingredients we was actually holding them in this week's option picks, but realized an earnings report was about to come out. So sold them before that earnings report came out and was very lucky to do so because it dropped dramatically. But now, in this last week, it's starting to move up from that drop. So it's currently at $86.04 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $114.86 a share in the next 12 months. They are going to give out a dividend. But to be eligible for that dividend, you have to own them by March 14th. And that dividend will be 12 cents a share. Now, for those who are not familiar with MGP ingredients, they actually are a company which makes alcohol, whiskey, bourbon, things of that nature. But it's a little more interesting than that. They don't just sell it to individuals like you and me. They actually sell their ingredients to other alcohol manufacturers as well. So many al smaller alcohol manufacturers that sell you alcohol and you think they make that alcohol, they may be actually buying it from MGP ingredients, relabeling it and selling it to you. Archer Daniels Midland, and you'll notice they dropped significantly a few weeks back. They are a one star, currently at $65.92 a share. They have an earnings report coming out, which can basically be any time from Monday to Wednesday. So if that earnings report drops Monday and you're in them, it's too late to get out, but not if it drops Wednesday. 
Devon Energy Corporation. They are one star, currently at $44.39 a share. Yahoo analysts believe they can move up to $52.68 a share in the next 12 months. They are about to give a dividend, but to be eligible for that dividend, you have to own them before March 14th, and the dividend will be $0.44 cents a share. Yum China is another stock that we owned in this week's option picks. We actually sold it, but we made around 44% on it before we sold it, and that's in under a month. In any event, Yum China Holdings is a one star, currently at $42.95 a share. Yahoo analysts believe they can move up to $57.80 a share in the next 12 months. Now, for those who are not familiar with what Yum China Holdings does, there's a company in America called Yum Brands. Yum Brands is basically KFC, Pizza Hut, and Taco Bell. Well, Yum China Holdings believe it's a subsidiary of Yum Brands, but they are KFC, Pizza Hut, and Taco Bell, as well as other restaurants, but in China. The Mosaic Company, currently at $31.63 a share, they are a two-star. Yahoo analysts believe they can go up to $38.24 a share in the next 12 months. They are about to give a dividend, but you have to own them by March 6 to be eligible for this dividend, and the dividend will be $0.21 cents a share. Exxon Mobil Corporation. They are a one star, currently at $105.84 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can go up to $124.89 a share in the next 12 months. John Bean Technologies, another stock that will be removed from the watch list after this. They're about to give a dividend, but you have to own that before March 8th to be eligible for that dividend, and that dividend will just be $0.10 cents a share. Well, they are a two-star, currently at $101.77 a share, moving in a sideways pattern, but Yahoo analysts only estimate that they can go up to $103 in the next 12 months. Bristol Myers, another one to be removed after this week. Bristol Myers Squibb Company is a two star, currently at $50.89 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $56.30 a share in the next 12 months. Arrow Electronics another stock to be removed. They are one star. They've moved up the last three weeks, currently at $120.19 a share. But Yahoo analysts estimate that they can move up to $120 in the next 12 months, which is actually below where they are right now. Cable One. Cable One is a two-star, been negative for a few weeks, had a slight positive week last week. They are currently at $457.63 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $635.50 a share 
in the next 12 months. National Research Corporation, currently at $40.56 a share. They are a three-star, fundamentally sound. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $46.51 a share in the next 12 months. They've been positive the last four weeks. Now, they will be giving a dividend, but you have to own them before March 27 to be eligible for that dividend. And the dividend will be $0.12 cents a share. Air Products and Chemicals. They are a two-star. Currently at $236 a share. Yahoo analysts estimate they can move up to $268.16 a share in the next 12 months. Now, they are going to give a dividend, but you have to own them by March 28th in order to be eligible for that dividend, and it will be $1.77 a share. Now, Air Products and Chemicals was mentioned in our this week's option picks. Um, every generally from the this week's winning stocks, I choose one particular stock that I feel will do well as an option. But I don't just pick it. I actually buy it. And I show you guys the results of it over weeks. So let's see how air products and chemicals are doing. I bought air products and chemicals on February 9th. At that time, it was $1,320.66 for an option contract at the strike price that lasted around four months. Well, from that time, and now we're in March 2nd, so maybe around three weeks, it's up $1,046.90. So I'm sitting on top of, and anybody who would have listened to me when I said it, and they would have bought it as well, we're sitting on top of a 79.21% return in around three weeks. CSG Systems, they are a two-star, currently at $54.52 a share. Yahoo analysts believe they can move up to $66.63 a share in the next 12 months. They are about to give a dividend, but you have to own them before March 14th to be eligible for that dividend. And the dividend is thirty cents a share. Haymanetics Corporation. They are a two star. Currently at seventy four dollars and sixteen cents a share. Yahoo analysts believe they can move up to a hundred and four dollars and forty three cents a share in the next twelve months. The last Two weeks have been slightly positive, but they're still sort of moving in a sideways pattern. AMN Healthcare. They are a two-star, currently at $56.81 a share. Yahoo analysts believe they can move up to $77.43 a share in the next 12 months. Now notice in two weeks they dropped significantly. But in this previous week, this last week, they had a green candle, not significant, but it moved up a little, so we want to see what happens with them. Vicor Corporation. 
They are a one star. Currently at $37.69 a share. Yahoo analysts believe they can move up to $53.50 a share in the next 12 months. Now they are, like we said, they're a one star. They dropped pretty significantly the previous week, but this last week it was a slightly positive candle. So we want to see what happens with them moving forward. So that should be it for, that's it for our this week's winning stocks, this week's guys. Um, in any event, if you are f- not familiar with options, we have, or I have videos on the channel which explain options. And for those who are familiar with them, you may want to look into this week's option picks as well. And please consider what I said with the Patreon channel. And in any event, you guys have a great night. And I look forward to speaking to you in the next video.